welcome you all to our grand opening. I did mention this is a bit of a dream, and it does feel like a dream. If any of, any of you know me, I am not a business person in my DNA at all. But um, yeah, we have many people who are supporting us and partnering with us, so whatever limitations one of us has, other folks uh, step in. Okay. Just, um, yeah. I think first of all, I'd like to say again, thank you for coming because without a sense of your support and seen and unseen, we wouldn't have been able to step into this darkness um, and feel like there would be some at the other side. And so your presence here is really the main reason why we felt confident that we could go forward. Um, lacking community support, nothing can be accomplished, nothing of any significance. And so um, we felt that there was, that you were here. And we weren't sure, for sure, that you would show up, but here you are, and it just validates the, um, the swallowing of our fear and the stepping forward that it took to take all the little steps to arrive at this place. So thank you, and I, as we begin, I'd really like you to feel a part of this. This is as much your company as it is ours, and perhaps even more so, so thank you so much for being here. So this morning, uh, we will um, hear words from dignitaries from this area, and then we'll uh, break for lunch. Uh, there's lunch in our shop around back. There are washrooms. Uh, if you take your first right and right again, and feel free to meander wherever. There's also washrooms upstairs. Uh, just keep going, and you'll find down the stairs, uh, some washrooms as well. So, uh, I'd like to begin, uh, first of all, maybe, and we'll speak more to this after, our, during our presentation after lunch, but really the heart of our company is our heart and part of our intentions for starting this was to not only think forward to future generations, but also back to the life of this area and this region. And in this time of reconciliation, uh, we are fortunate to have at our beginning stages the proverbial uh, kitchen table napkin conversation with Roy Lewis and explaining the vision and the hopes for this company. Roy uh, took out a pencil and there's a napkin and uh, started to draw the four uh, symbols for the four elements. And he said, you should call your company Newo, which is the Cree word for four. So as he drew that, I took out my napkin, which comes in the form of a Mac laptop, and <laughs> started to render it into a design, and then uh, artist better, better than myself, Hans, is here, uh, produced the logo that um, you see on our publicity. So part of the initial impulse was reconciliation is more than just looking to the past and saying we acknowledge what has happened, but the flip side of reconciliation is building up a beautiful community and really the world that we um, you know, in some ways should have been doing all along. And so once you step forward into that space, then you start to imagine things and napkins become inspiration, which become dreams, which become people baking cookies this week. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> and many others, so many others. Uh, so just to let you know, and we'll talk further this afternoon, but this is uh, the initial impulse and impetus. So um, by way of beginning today, Roy Lewis uh, led us in a smudge ceremony this morning and uh, prayer, and we'd like to call upon him to um, send greetings and share some of his wisdom with us. So Roy, come, come to this side. 